Are drones just another gimmick? Are they just one of those trends that will die with time? This is actually how many people conceptualize the idea of drones currently. With this in mind, I genuinely hope your perception on drones is changed by the end of the speech. Now you may be wondering why I'm standing here giving a speech to you on drones. Well, actually, I've been fascinated by drones and the uses for a long time now. My first interaction with the drone was when I was, I'd say, around eight years old. I was, at, I was at the park with my friends when I noticed an older boy holding a remote controller. Out of curiosity, I began to try and find out what exactly he was trying to fly. As I began to search, to my surprise, I noticed an object flying far high in the sky, higher than I could ever imagine. And this was the moment in time I was introduced to the inspiring realm of drones. I went on a few years later to actually purchase my own drone. As I recall, it was an incredibly exhilarating and unique experience. As the co-founder of Microsoft, Bill Gates, once said, drones overall will be more impactful than I think people recognize in helpful ways to benefit society. Bill Gates, an esteemed icon in the world of technology, and many other knowledgeable tech leaders truly understand the potential and benefits of drone technology. Currently, you and I are most likely to see drones being used for recreational purposes. However, many professional photographers are fascinated by their ability to capture exquisite photos. YouTubers also admire the, the method of how they can capture distinctive footage of events and landscapes using the cameras within drones. Drones can not only provide a good source of entertainment, but can also help people benefit within certain career paths. Nonetheless, these are only the basic applications of drone technology. There are a plethora of other more advanced uses for drones. For instance, take a look at the agricultural sector. Agricultural drones are being used to increase the efficiency of the farming process by monitoring crops at a large scale, providing water for these crops, and increasing the rate at which crops are planted. On the other hand, drones are also being used for military purposes. Drones are being used in situations where man flight is considered far too risky, and also as a scouting method far high in the sky to provide valuable intel for the military. Another example of its vast impacts are drones in the film industry. Many sci-fi and action movies require aerial shots that are far too hard to achieve with normal cameramen. Given the quality of cameras in drones nowadays, drones are a powerful asset to the film industry in general and these movie genres. But why stop there? Why stop at what appears to be only the scratch of the surface of all possibilities? I could go on and on about the various different applications of drones currently, but that isn't the entire point of the speech. I believe that these uses is not as valuable compared to how and what drones will be used for in the future. What I really want for you to encompass is the future. The future for the world of drones along with fast developing technology and how eventually they will be used in our everyday lives in new, unique and interesting ways that we never would have thought were possible. Well, what exactly are these future applications? For starters, Amazon is currently developing a transportation system powered by drones called Amazon Primer, designed to deliver packages to customers within 30 minutes. However, if this is possible, can't we eventually be able to replicate the same idea but with humans? Is it really that much of a stretch of an idea? Drones can be used to transport people at fast speeds and unlike most airlines, can do so within a country. Furthermore, drones can be used to transport people to hospitals who are in need of urgent critical medical care and can do so at rapid speeds by simply avoiding traffic. Similarly, drones can be used during natural disasters such as floods where rescue is urgent. On the note of medical care, the same can be done vice versa. Drones can instead be used to transport first aid kits and medical kits to people who do not have a fast access to them. I firmly believe that as time progresses, drone developers and technology developers will be able to minimize the size of drones immensely. I also be believe that drones will become the number one means of collecting and gathering data for things for um, collecting data for things such as weather forecasting and disaster management. I also believe that the sports community will be affected as with the continuous investments in drone technology, drones will be used for things like obstacle courses and racing for, to provide entertainment, not only for the racing, not only for the social community, but as well as the technological community. However, one must always keep in mind that as technology develops ever so quickly, there will inevitably be some sort of potential repercussions or another due to drone technology. This is why society must do its best to prevent drones from being used for any malicious intents to combat these potential repercussions to the best of their ability. For example, drones may be used to develop a culture of fear worldwide that is fueled by extreme violence attacks, by terrorist groups, and by the military. Finally, 
I do believe that one day we'll be able to glance up into the big blue sky and see countless wonderful drones flying elegantly above our heads, providing unimaginable value to our lives. I hope you have gained the right notion of, how, of the possibilities of drones and how far we can progress as individuals and as a society together. As we know, technology is developing faster than ever. And with that, drones are certain to improve as well. That's why I highly encourage you to welcome this great development with open arms and to embrace it, as this world of drones will come much sooner than most think. Thank you.